Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another live learn session. I am Sabelo, your number one Photoshop tutor, and I'm back with another Photoshop tutorial for you guys. Where I'm gonna be picking a famous album cover and then showing you how to recreate all the effects step by step. Now, in this video, we're gonna be doing the album Sean Mendes by the homie Sean Mendes. Now, I know this might look intimidating at first, but trust me, at the end of this video, you won't even know what intimidating is. So, without wasting any more time, let's go ahead and jump into Photoshop and start the tutorial. Okay, so first thing to do is create a new project, of course. Then insert your subject image. Click and drag it over to your main project and now press Ctrl C on your keyboard to scale up your subject until the face fits right inside your project's canvas. Now using the curvature tool, start drawing these freeform shapes on the left and right side of your subject's face. And then select both your shapes and go to the top where it says selection, click on it and then click OK here to make a selection out of this. Now while layer 1 is active, press Ctrl J on your keyboard to make cutouts from your selections. Then press and hold Ctrl while you click on layer 2 to make a new selection. Then go back to layer 1 and press backspace to make some holes on the face layer. Now use the rectangular marquee tool to select and drag your face cutouts to the left and right respectively. Then while you're still on layer 2, add a bevel and embos effect. Set the style to add a bevel technique to chisel hard then for highlight mode color choose a color just the same as your subject skin color but a little bit lighter and adjust furthermore according to what looks good in your project then press ok go to layer 1 and add a bevel and emboss effect as well but change the style to outer bevel this time Adjust the other values according to your preference and press OK. Now click your background layer, then go to the color picker and select a dark color. Then press and hold Alt on your keyboard and press backspace to fill your background with the dark color. And then you can now insert the flowers. Click and drag each one over to your project. Make sure the flower layers are above layer 1 but below layer 2. Then press Ctrl T to open free transform to scale and rotate your flowers accordingly. Now go to the top layer and click on it, then add a hue and saturation layer, go to the presets drop down menu and select sepia. Then decrease the saturation to give it more color.
then decrease the hue and search layer opacity to 64 or less to make it less effective. Now we gotta add a rough paper texture to the whole picture and luckily I found the perfect texture image on Google. Click and drag it over to your project and make sure it's above all layers except the adjustment layer. Scale it up. And change the blending mode to overlay. Then go to image and click auto tone to kind of break down the brightness a little and make it less shiny then decrease the opacity. Now go back to layer 2 which is your face shapes layer and then add a drop shadow effect. And then boom, mission completed guys, you have successfully created your own live learn certified Sean Mendes album cover. Now that's the end of this session guys, please like if you learned anything from today's video and if there's an album cover that you'd like me to recreate, leave a comment down below, I'll check that out and hopefully recreate it for my next video. Your suggestions are much appreciated. Now please subscribe to my channel and help me help you guys by creating more dope and awesome content. And that's it for today's video. I will see you on the next one.